Hi guys, thanks for joining me again today. It's Mitch from Smart PE, and today I'm going to be looking at a smarter way to learn about fitness testing, and in particular the one rep max test. Now this test measures maximal strength, and it will start with an athlete lifting a weight that they know that they are capable of for one repetition only. Now what you're then looking to do is you're looking to gradually increase the weight that you started from to try and get to an end point. So what we're looking for is, let's imagine I started on 40 kilos and can do one rep, I increased it to 45, I could do one rep, I increased it to 50, I could do one rep. If I then increase it to 55, if I cannot complete one full repetition, then my one rep max, we could estimate as being at 50 kilos. Now we could go one step further, I suppose. We could gradually increase the weight a little bit more. I know I can't lift 55, but I can lift 50. So I then might build up an increment of one or two kilograms, for example, just to get my true number. I must complete one full repetition of the weight. Now your score is the final amount of weight that you're able to complete one full repetition of. Now below we have a normative data table and a question. Which is the correct rating for Simon, given his score of 72 for the bench press one rep max test? So we're looking to analyse the data and work out where this 72 would fall between. We know it's not less than 45 or um, less than 57 or greater than 117. So hopefully through looking at the table, we can work out that Simon's score would be average. Now scan another QR code to find out about another fitness test.